I like posted a link and I said like, okay, it's time. Like you guys oh, have been fans, asking, yeah. uh, link in bio. That's why I said I said link in bio, which is dog whistle for only fans, right? But then when I went back to check, how many people I click the link? Fifty thousand. Fifty thousand, and I was just thinking if I charge if I charge ten dollars each. I mean, you know that you have a market there, Bank. Jay, but it's um, just yeah, let, let, let me invest. How do I decide to pursue further studies or not? Would it be a waste of time slash money? How to juggle together with no full-time job? <laughs> That's very long. What's your highest education? Guess. Wait, uh. Can you ask that? Yeah. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> uh, I'm an almost open book. Okay, I feel like... Okay, the first time I met uh, Ben, so, okay. so, so like the Sam Willow side, the first time I met Ben, I was like, you look like you have a degree. Interesting. Did you say that yeah. to him? Did you yes. Really? I, I was like, look, like we were, No we were face? talking about education I'm like Which uni do you go to? It's like I didn't go to uni And I'm like no lie It's like I really didn't go to uni I'm like you look like A, a uni boy like, what, you look How like does a uni boy look? Yeah. Like, he's very like Okay no, <laughs> no Okay he, like he's He's an AC boy right? Yeah he Yeah is, yeah So yeah. I feel like when you see an AC boy You know he's, he's an AC boy Like they sit yeah, no, proper that's true. They okay. speak proper So I thought he would have been In uni lah This question might break my heart Do I look like a uni boy? Yeah <laughs> <laughs> Come on! You do, you do, you do. Oh, no, I, okay. I do! You look like a. Are you a Neon boy? I was not a Neon boy. Okay. Yeah. TP. You got that. I wasn't even poly, I was in NAFA. Oh. There you go. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Is okay, that okay. a uni? Okay. Yeah. No, that's a diploma, but you can, okay. do a, you can do a degree there also. Right. No, no, I don't have a degree actually. Oh, wow. Yeah. My highest is um, diploma in mass comm. Then oh, okay. after that, because yeah. it was really expensive, and then I didn't have the money to mm. do my degree, because mm. I didn't do well enough to get into like a local school. And then. Yeah, so then I got a job to try to pay back my loans for the diploma. Mm -hmm. Then I got promoted. Then I'm like, can we swear? Yeah, I can. Oh, then I'm like, fuck this degree. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then I was like, okay. Then I just started working from then. Okay. Yeah. You, so are you a degree holder? No, diploma in theatre. So Jay is the smartest one here. Yeah, I think, <gasps> she, hey, so I think she's the only saying. one with, with a degree or master's, right? What's a degree? No, I don't. I just have a degree. Okay, like a, okay. Just a plain old degree. In but psychology um, from NUS. Exactly. Yeah. That's a flex right there. Man. I, yeah. Honestly, I don't think so. It was actually super, super easy. Like, I'm not kidding. It's actually very easy to get a degree once you get into school. Mm. But the studying. The, it's hard to get in. But once you're in, there's not, you don't have to do shit. To study? What do you mean? You don't need to study? You don't, yeah, you can, I, I never came for any classes. I would just, like my teachers would be like, Jay, you need to show up for class, you need to get marks. And I'm like, you know what? I, I literally told my teacher this. I was like, you just wait for the final exam. I'm a beast. I will make all, like, I'm going to get a solid B for this. I do not want an A. I just don't want to come for your classes. So I'm really sorry. Wait, why don't you want an A? I didn't want an A because uh, you have to come to classes for an A. Because oh. there's class part. So I just said like, all the class stuff, I'll just forgo it. So what do you want to be? What did I want to be? Yeah. I want to be. Oh, so if you don't come for class, you get B? Yeah, because like, you show up in the final exam and then you just like... That's fucking easy. The questions are damn easy. <laughs> That's okay. very efficient. So I'm yeah. in psychology, right? So the questions are like, um, is it normal to stick your toothbrushes uh, into your nose? No. And you're like, no, it's not. <laughs> Wait, you, uh, psychology, crazy, right? Um, huh? Yeah. Oh. Abnormal okay. psychology or like brain stuff. Like It's basically things that you learn in like JC, recycled. Huh. What you learn? What did you learn in GC? Yeah. Yeah. Do <laughs> not no, put the no, no, that was like for one class, lah. But oh, it's like, okay, okay, it's like okay. they're like, okay, well, like, uh, at what age do kids develop theory of mind? Basically, that they're just asking, like, at what age are kids like not Let's selfish, try. not assholes? Theory of mind. Six. It doesn't matter. You just need to be oh. yeah six. That's oh, she's wow. right. She's right. You get a degree. I told you, it's fucking easy. <laughs> I'm a easy. wizard. You so get have a to go to class, right Yeah, it's, it is. It's actually fucking so easy. So what? What made you pursue a degree in NUS then? My mother forced me. <laughs> <laughs> so you? I didn't want to. I I trust me. I didn't want to go to school. Oh. I just wanted to okay. be. I just wanted to like look hot and. Chill. Honestly, yeah. I feel if it benefits your paycheck, if it inc if it increases your paycheck by like one k or two k, yeah, then go do for it. it man. But like, if it doesn't, then do you need it? That's the thing. Mm. Yeah. I feel like our generation, uh, we are not. Are we? Okay, yeah. we are I think we're all like almost yes. the same. Yeah, same. I feel our generation got lucky. Yeah. Because when we were growing up, right, social media came about, or like mm. creative work were in demand. Like photography, la, videography and everything. So people started to get creative. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I feel like the, for the generation after us, it's quite hard. 
because then we are already doing it. We are there are so many good people out there. So if they want to explore in this field, it's going to be harder for them. So my advice is stay in school. Yeah. Actually, yeah. yeah. All right. Like I mean, do it for yourself. If if you want to do it, then do it. But yeah, you know. like if like uh, I think <coughs> for music, I think um, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, like the Sam Willows were like, who were the biggest before Sam Willows? Fifty-three A. A lot. Yeah. Yeah, but they were Jack, like Jack and Ray, Electrical, Ray. Ah, okay, like Electrical oh. and then like, uh, like the Game era, Sunset, right? You know? Yeah, and yeah. also all our generation. That's why I say so after. <coughs> and then I feel like okay, let's say you want to be creative, you want to make music, and then you have to go against like people like you, Raja. Farid but now there's so many more than there were. Yeah. That's yeah. Like, like contradicts you. <laughs> I think uh, the important thing, and and that's something that everyone's bringing up, is that it depends what field you're in. Mm. Uh, so the best advice I think I can offer is that you should ask someone who is an expert in the field that you're interested in and uh. ask whether in their experience and in their life whether the degree and the specific course you're looking at is worth it or not. True. Because we can give you advice. We I don't think, we I don't think we should all know. read a Dennis Joe's story. Auntie uh. Lucy, who's doing his diploma right now in uh, Niam Poly, but he's like nearing 50 already. Oh, but shit. it's awesome. Oh, wow. But see, because he wants to do exactly. it, not because he was forced to do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I was not actually. I you know I, I was never, never. I my I have the lowest education between all of you. Like what? I'm at N level. Oh, okay. And then after that, I joined school. I quit school. I joined There's school. There's no I quit lowest school. education. I mean, between all of you guys, the lowest is probably PSLE lah, right? Okay, but take take uh, advice for me because I'm a school dropout. I don't know. Do you earns the most? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> and probably earns the most. No, we don't know that. Yeah. Uh, uh, I think they earns the most on the couch. Oh, oh, maybe Jet. Oh, you know, uh, from a uh, school dropout, I would say stay in school. Because yeah. um, I yeah. struggled. As in, okay, I, I, my first ever job was, I mean, if you take away like the events boy stuff, the, my first ever job that I actually have to use my brains and like, you know, go against like, meet people and like meet clients where I actually have clients where I was in an agency. Right? And then uh, I saw the difference of not having a degree versus having a degree when I was actually doing work. Mm. You know, like I had to contest against people who had a degree and they were just so much faster. They think so much faster. They speak so much better. I didn't even know how to send an email. Eh. <laughs> you don't learn how to send an email in uni. What do you think we have like email no, writing class? No, what but you, you have? have an email no. in uni. We don't. No, you have an email in uh, in Yeah, but in I don't Poly, send right? things off with Jade Rasif so at like nus.edu. Nus. Okay. I send it off at hotmail.com. Uh, how about Microsoft Office? Like, no, they would, I'm, I'm sure they will teach right? Microsoft Word, Microsoft PowerPoint. Like right? presentations so, yeah, and yeah, stuff. They, will teach they you would how not to, like, teach you. No, you need to know that before you get in. Oh, oh, uni? Yeah, really? Sure. Yeah, yeah, it's called oh. Project Work. You all did it, right? In the no, no. <laughs> okay, so I was in IT college East for two weeks. Before, oh, okay. Before, oh, so you was, oh, yeah, okay, no, okay. Before, so before Singapore. Really we relate, yeah. My pioneer set got, got born. No. no. So, <laughs> one of the first few things they teach you is how to use Microsoft Office, Microsoft Word, Excel, like, you know, double tap and like the proper ways to write thesis and write like compositions using the app. Mm. So, yeah, I think it's a it's basic knowledge we should all have. Yeah, no, yeah. but we didn't learn that in uni. To okay. get into uni, you need to use Microsoft Outward to write a document, to submit it, to say mm. why you want to be mean, in the uni. If you <laughs> don't know how to use a <laughs> Word document. Yeah, I don't. Last time, I don't know. Eh. But <laughs> I went, and you know, hey, last, time, no, you, last time, YouTube just launched some more, so there was no Damn. fucking tutorial on oh, how to true. use. Actually, that's quite hard. Yeah, yeah so yeah, I had struggles. to learn everything yeah. myself. And when I asked like my colleagues, they yeah. would look at me like, huh? Like, mm. how the fuck do you even get this job? And <laughs> I was just lucky because my boss really liked me. How come? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. See, that's the thing, right? Then, then again, these days here in Singapore, people are asking the question, do I really need a degree if I already know the business or mm, know the industry? Right. Do I just Can I just use my street smarts? That's why I feel like a degree might increase your paycheck, but if, if the street smart, the basic knowledge, you're more or less settled in the job already. Depends what the job requires. I mean, if mm-hmm. you're going to be a doctor, then you better yeah, get yeah, your yeah, 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 Some, some yeah, jobs some, yeah, exactly, <laughs> like a lawyer or whatever. But I feel like at the end of the day... Or like a pilot... <laughs> Do what's you your what's your experience pilot? of flight simulator? No, yeah. doesn't go that way. Like like I'm <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> of course a pilot. Oh, yeah, okay. Sorry, continue. No, but I mean like I feel like as long as you educate yourself, I, yeah. it doesn't have to come in the form of degree or like mm. the typical of what you think school is or what education is. But as long as you're educating yourself, even if you don't go to school and don't get a degree, then you're you're still bettering yourself. I think that's okay. You know. Yeah. 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 Mm. Pretend to read a page out of a diary of the person next to you. 
tell all the details. Oh wow! Ah. Ah. So do you want me? Whoa. Well, I mean, if it's Jade, I I kind of know what to say because I was with her almost like the past week. Oh. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, Pretend yeah, yeah. Jade is talking <gasps> rubbish about you. Oh. <laughs> In an Australian accent. <laughs> oh, no, no, well, this is uh, okay. Oh my god. To die. That yeah. was sick. To die. <laughs> you know, dear diary. Uh, I'm probably screwing up right now, yeah. Okay. Dear diary, I spent the last four days in Manchester with Jokin Gomez mm-hmm. and Toby Tan, Toby Yato. Um, Toby was a nice guy, but Jokim, seriously, she's talking crap about me, uh, talking shit about yeah, me, guys, yeah. stemming me, right? But, but Jokim is a. <laughs> I feel I feel Joakim shouldn't have been there. I think he brought the brand down. <gasps> oh, oh, I would yeah. never do that. Yeah, I don't Jay, know. Jay, Jay, that's not Jay, how Jay, I No, come on. The way I thought Jay. crab is so different. Like Joakim, I, I think Joakim's fashion sense needs to improve. Like oh my God. him next to me, my goodness, it's like yeah, some yeah, street yeah. kid next to a princess. Yeah, that's so Jade. Okay, done. That's not how I think that's how Jade. No, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Yeah, you know why? Because I didn't talk trash about people on the show. I'd be like, wow, this guy, he fucked. Fucking asshole, yeah, I cheat by fucking dog. Like, yeah, why the yeah. fuck was Joakim there? Words. Fucking irritating. Every time he sit next to me, he breathes his breath into my ear. I feel like the air is Wait, what? <laughs> what are you guys doing in Manchester? <laughs> what are you doing, Joakim? <laughs> Words you all can say, but I can't. But how, no. how would I breathe into your ear? Like? I, no, but like, that's what I would be like. Okay, fucking okay, okay, Joakim okay. every morning, wake up so fucking early to go running, them fucking irritating. Yeah, yeah I saw a story that you walk 10 run, 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 run. Yeah, but Check that's out my I run. Care. To the point where when I saw her at the lobby having breakfast, right? And then she was like, are you going for a run now? I was like, yeah, <laughs> okay. No, Oops. he said, I'm going for, a, no lah, I'm a bit tired. I'm just maybe like a casual walk. A, a walk. casual 10-kilometer walk. How long do you what take? What the fuck is that? About an hour plus lah. But went, that's amazing. Yeah, your dedication Wait, to, to run. Wait, to walk 10 yeah. you took an hour. Yeah. Yeah. That's running. No, but I'm, I'm a fast walker. I'm, huh? I'm, I'm, I like to walk <laughs> very far. Huh? An hour yeah. plus, an hour plus. Like an hour 20, an hour 15. To walk. To walk, thank you. Yeah. 10 click yeah. every what? day. But from, from like my lobby to like Manchester City Central and back to my hotel lobby That's again. That's crazy. Yeah. And he called I it take casual. One hour to run 10 km. That's great. Yeah, same. That's great timing. <laughs> one hour yeah, plus. But you take one, you one hour took, plus. Like yeah, one 20 hour more 20. minutes to walk. Do you power walk? Like No, but I walk fast. I walk fast. Mm. I and like it's really great to walk there. Like the weather is amazing. Yeah. It's beautiful, man. 11 so degrees nice. weather. He was okay. out every day at like 7. He'll go for a morning run. Yo. <laughs> You like the old man downstairs my house. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting that. I'm getting that right now. At 5 a.m. Wow. So nice, huh? Like, Joggy Gomez. His nickname is Jogging Gomez. Yeah. Jogging Gomez. It is really oh good. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey. Wow, the Twitch community there's is a, really there's smart. A, no, there's a story behind this. So there's like a... Wait, this is like a legit, like an official thing? Yeah, there, no, there's a story behind this. So there was one, um, this guy on Instagram, right? And he, mm. he likes to swear a lot in Tamil. So one, so one day he was like running his own right race, right? He tags me in a post saying, "Oh my God, Joking Gomez, I should call you Jogging Gomez," you know. And he, yeah, he goes on in Tamil, and I was like laughed. So I reshared it on my Instagram post, and everyone just started doing Jogging Gomez, Gomez as my nickname. And there's actually a Twitch <laughs> icon of mm. me of my face on a shoe, so they call it the Jogging Gomez shoe. Wow, I love yeah. that. wow that's merch. Right yeah, there. yeah, yeah. But I mean, would you run with my face? Yeah. On a sh- <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Maybe it gives you motivation. Yeah. No, if I can run it. There you go. That's the shoe, right? Right? That's the shoe right there. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, if, you see, that's, if you zoom in, you'll see wow. my face. That's right your there, face? Yeah. yeah. Wow. It's like stepping on my face all the time. You have, wow, you have, wow. No, not really. It's like, it's like stepping with you, supporting us every step of the way. Sure. Mm. Uh, I'll see it that yeah. way. Yeah, I can okay, drag so me in the mud. Okay, so if he is jogging Gomez, what will you, what will you be? Oh. Mm. Jogging S- Gomez, S- Riley. Why S? Oh. Sandra? Only friends oh. call me Sandra. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay, so yeah. only friends call oh. me Sandra. Yeah. Oh. No, but so no, you guys call no, no, no. Okay, <laughs> okay. 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 Riley. <laughs> Right, dub- r- 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 the privilege of calling me r- uh, Sandra. Oh, I'm confused now. <laughs> <laughs> Who am I? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Riding Riley. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Jogging Gomez. Mm-hmm. Something Should Riley. Should like running, right? Why running, would you think Riley, of riding? Riding, riding, riding. 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 Donkey. Donkey. Isabella. <laughs> <Abelas>. My friend. <laughs> there it is. Oh, yeah. There we it is. See, riding kind of sus. Yeah. I apologize. I'm going to become raging riding. <laughs>
Why, why, why did you directed <laughs> yeah. at Jay straight like, away with such confidence? Uh, to a more productive lifestyle. <clears throat> In terms of health and removing bad habits and progressing to a more productive oh, life. Wow. Okay, yeah, I like, yeah, yeah I mean, you're like, how do you change that? I'm, I'm like, be more productive then. <laughs> like, I don't know. No, I guess there are um, okay, there are times where I so feel like I'm in that spot. Yeah. Like, mm. I just how do I make my life better? Mm. Yeah. Based on what is happening now. I feel like that's a great question for you, Dio. Why? Because you were in that spot last year. Oh, that's with true. With me, remember? And then, like, he was super unproductive, and then he just come to my house and cry every day. What wait, what is considered? And then complain and what about is mosquitoes. That's also that's also a good question. Oh yeah. Yeah. True. So I feel like. I think from what I got out from that experience, what's productive is what you can do. La. Hmm. You know, for example, for example, like, I have no job. Oh, I want to be a lawyer. No, I can't do that. Because I don't okay. have the, the means to be a lawyer. So it's like... But then you can study and then become ah, a lawyer. Ah, then you can, yeah, then that's a productive. That's ah, okay, so if you're working on it, okay. yeah. then that's productive. So if you're yeah. working on your goals, therefore you're productive. <clears throat> yeah. Or rather, if... Okay, based on my experience... Um, like what Jade said I was there once right was because that um, I I had something and that something should be more but it's not becoming more <laughs> okay. you get what I mean <laughs> thank you for example you want to be you're already a singer okay. and you know you can be the number one singer okay. in Southeast Asia okay. you know okay. you know how to get there but you're just not doing it you know how to get there but you're not doing it yeah. okay can I can I can I like tell them what happened go for it oh yeah sure if you don't mind. Okay, yeah, so basically mind. what happened was that Dew lost his job. Mm. He got he got fired or quit or I don't know what happened there. But he lost his job and he was like unemployed. And then like, it was really bad because it was right before COVID or right when COVID happened. So like um, media agencies weren't hiring and he had never like not worked in an office job before. We were all, he was always under someone else's employment. So basically he had to start a new business in like the hardest of times, like mm. by himself. So there was no just saying show. And... So, like, he was like, okay, well, I'm going to start my own show. And then he, number one, set very clear goals, knew what, had to figure out what he wanted, and then reached out to people who he felt could help him along the way. And that's what he did. And that's how he moved out. But it took a lot of mental focus and a lot of, yeah, yeah respect, it was great. It was hard. It was hard, yeah. though. It's not easy. I yeah. think everyone has their own story. Like, for you, it's like you losing your job. For me, mm. it's like being mm-hmm. so sad over a breakup, being so sad over like not achieving what I wanted to do in the past three or four years. So for me, product being productive means like for every day that I have mm. that I'm able to breathe in this world, I want to make full use of it, like do my work, go for a run, go for mm, a gym, mm, you know, mm. ha- uh, and enjoy time with friends. So th- there was a time where I was really sad, stress eating, you know, just not doing anything. And then when I looked in the mirror, I saw myself balloon to 80 kg. I oh, went, wow. Okay, that's this is bad. I got to stop. So I think... It just takes that mental switch and that mm. discipline to commit to it. Yeah. Then you can hopefully achieve your goals. Actually, the greatest thing that I learned from that experience is only one thing to be honest, which is time management. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I feel like, oh, mm. wow. Yeah. Why? Yes. Yeah. I have a love hate relationship with, with time, time management. management yeah. yeah. Time management gets you places, guys. And you have to be very strict about it. Like, this hour I have to do this. This hour I have to do this. And for you to only get good at something, you need to spend time doing it. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So like I wake up, I make sure I wake up at a certain time. I make sure I work out at that time. I make sure that I am working on something at that time. Yeah. So that's actually um productivity comes from there. Because you know that what you, you you're supposed to do this at this time. And if you're not doing this at this time, means you're not productive. Lah. Yeah. But I mean, that's like a, it is a luxury to mm. have the ability to do time management because once yeah. you have a child, your time oh, management yeah. is like out the fucking window. There's no such thing as true. your own time. I'll be like, I'm going to wake up at 7 a.m. I'm going to drop my son off at school and I'm going to go do yoga. I'm mm-hmm. going to go for a spin class. Mm-hmm. And then like, oh, he has the then sniffles. Yeah. yeah. I get a call from the school. Oh, your son just bit somebody. Come pick him up. And I'm like, <gasps> wow, good job. Oh, the my now. whole fucking day is gone. Yeah, my whole, there's no such time management. You know mm. what I mean? So it's, it's like but I feel like once you have a luxury. kid, yeah, you're already being productive forget every Forget it. Yeah, no, yeah. but forget about your career. Forget about your career. So how do you give yourself a break then? That's my question. I call my mom like, mom, take him. Oh, <laughs> take him. Fair enough. Fair take enough. him. Fair enough. Oh my God, I miss if let's say I want to have kids, I have to be close again to my dad. Hey, one lah. You have to. No, oh, who's no, going to? It's yeah, free childcare. Hire, hire nanny. You can't hire people to raise your... It's hard. Oh, no lah. Not raise my child. Just take like my child when I don't want yeah. them. For it, that, 
few so hours. Nowadays, <laughs> days, <laughs> let me tell you, nowadays, like, even grandparents are spoiled. Like, in the good old days, like, the grandparents will just take your kids, right? Your parents will take your kids. Now they're like, I'll take the kid and the mate. Oh. Like, okay. Ah, okay, 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 okay. It happens, it happens. <laughs> so, oh, I, thought you, I thought they were in my head, like, they were going to no, ask you for money. Be, no, no, no. I no, don't no. mind paying. No. Yeah, right? Yeah. Oh, they <laughs> will do. So hard, right? Yeah, no, yeah, but like they do. If my too, grandmother asked for $100, they? Yeah, small yeah, yeah. Like, mm. My grandma used to ask for money, like, yeah. Oh, hey, they, they. Interesting. Yeah, oh. but you got to get the money. Yeah, but you have to, like, you know. Actually, babies are only annoying when they cry, lah. Yeah, which is all the time, ah. Right, and then when you which poop, is all that time. I, I, I'm okay with changing diapers. Okay, why? Because I all never tried it. Why they like poop on you or like <laughs> yeah. like puke on you and pee on ah, you? Yeah, yeah. And then, then how? It's not a problem. Yeah. Oh, so it's not, I yeah. like it doesn't happen. No, no, it's not a problem because it's not a ghost when it's your own kid. Oh yeah, but but for him, I'm just I'm asking. Yeah, yeah. Would it be ghost? I, I'm, for you? I'm like quite OCD, and so when all these types of things happen, I'm like. Mm. Really? Like when I shed my pants, you know. Oh, oh, yeah. this is sad. <laughs> yeah. So I shed my pants at 27. I hate this story. I need to hear the story. Yeah. Because in the last episode, la, like every stream. Muna gave me so much shit about it. <laughs> long, long story cut short, I forgot my house keys and I just, I had, I really needed to shit and I didn't want to shit on the floor. So I just shed my pants. Were you having like a tummy ache? Like yes. a massive diarrhea. It was yeah, a, after, I, high, uh, after a certain hot pot. Okay, fine. I didn't want to say the name. <laughs> but yeah. there we go. Oh. Yeah. So then I... Th- then I said I took off my shoes first and then Muna was like <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Oh that's smart. Did you have yeah. did you have like ta la or something? Yeah, uh, like, it was just oh. wet. What ta big big no, no, as, as, as in your Haiti Lao pot, right? The mala. Oh, 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 like, oh, so, oh no, I'm my so tummy sorry. just works in very like <laughs> no, weird ways. I mean we I love I love having hot pot, but yeah, it happens yeah. once in a while to no, me as well. I mean, wait, like you shit your pants No 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 but the I just thought we can relate. <laughs> the the post the post mala poop. No oh, one yes. can relate to Wait, this so, story. So, so, so gross. Then, then, as in you're stuck outside your house, mm. and then you're like, "Damn, I gotta go." Yeah. And then, what was the plan of getting the keys? Like, what? Were, yeah. No, I had no plan. So he I, had no oh, key. Okay, I, I first yeah, called my parents, key? and then my parents were like, "No, we're not coming home in the next like three hours." So I was like, "Fuck, right? I really need. I I didn't mind going out again, but I really oh. needed to go." Wait, you didn't mind going out again? Like, I didn't mind going out to wait for my parents for three hours, but I needed to shit. Ah, okay, okay, okay. 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 So trust me when I say I didn't want to shit my fucking pants. Yeah, of course. Like, of course. Like, <laughs> Thank you, Muna didn't believe me. Muna said it. You like, wanted Muna. to. No, but like yeah. we just wanted to ask, like, what about plants? Don't you have plants? Yeah. I don't have plants outside my house. Okay, then what happened after that for the next three hours? Yeah. The- yeah. <laughs> so I was underwearless for the next three hours, lah. Oh, that's oh, right. so okay, the, okay. but you okay, were wearing your pants. I mean, I was sitting at my stairs and just waiting there, lah. Wait, but then there's also poop on your butt. Yeah. Okay. So why? Why didn't so you I take off everything no, and then like no. just I like sh- how we're going, going, floor, right? we're going the deeper and yeah. deeper, deeper into, into this right now. Mm. So what I did was I took off my shoes and then I shed. In your shoes? No. Nope. <laughs> were you squatting? Were you? I Wait, why did you take off I, your shoes? I, because I don't want to dirty my shoes. But now. how will you dirty your shoes? Exactly, this is what because everyone you said. Right <laughs> were you stood up or were you squatting? I was I stood up, I stood up. No, that, that, that's why. You were standing? Yeah, Hey, because, okay, if you squat and shit, right, the shit will... <laughs> but then it won't touch your it mom. Will, it will. Why? It will. Because Why? you are squatting. Because you're you're hey, good. Oh, yeah. I see, I see. There I we see, go. I Come, see, let's let's get a live demo. Okay, so how are you how are you? I like like this? So it, it was then? trickling down his pants. Yeah. Oh, it was, it was rolling trickling, down your pants. Yeah, yeah. Wouldn't it be better if you were lying down? Then it will like. Oh, no, <laughs> no, then no, it won't drip down your pants. Smart. No, oh, I thought lie down so you don't need a pool. Or ha- hang upside down. Maybe the pool go back. In my oh. mouth? <laughs> no, it's <laughs> Okay, but whatever, yeah, that oh, happened. Oh, wow, interesting. Okay, okay. never mind. Anyway, I don't want to talk about this. <laughs> okay. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, no, no, cool, cool. cool. I feel we're closer cool, now. Cool, yeah. <laughs> we've shared a moment. <laughs> okay, me and her, I shared but you, But you and Muna, like, had the same reaction. You were like, why the fuck do you take off your shoes? Like, why is that a priority? Okay. To like, protect the goods. Because yeah. his shoes. Yeah, yeah. His shoes, there <laughs> It was the most expensive thing on me. I'm like, no, 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 I cannot shoot. I just needed yeah. something. But I think it's it. nice that you're like civic minded. Because honestly, I would have just gone out. Like, if I really, like, if the option was shit my pants or shit in a grass field, I'd just go down and yeah, I would shit have in a grass field. field. No, no, like, if, was, like, really, then after that, I would like write a long letter to the town council, like, apologizing and like, I'm really sorry. I cleaned it up. Mm. No, but I really <laughs> no choice already. Like, wherever I walk, right, it's just one, two steps. Confirm come out already. Yeah, <laughs> I know what you mean. Yeah, it's it that happens. kind of shit. It's Bro. like your ass shaking already, you know? Like you you're trying your to hold it. Yeah, anyway. Anyway. So long. I 
am currently a 90 kilogram female who's interested in losing weight and interested in changing my current lifestyle into a healthier one. Can you guys share your first steps and motivation and how you amazing people change your life into becoming healthier? How Also, how do you stay disciplined and motivated? Thank you. Oh, wow. Right. Like Sandra, it's a Sandra question. Yeah. Wow. This I is, don't know. My brain is still like on the previous question. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Why you want okay, to go? Well, Why you okay, want okay. to go? Okay, okay, okay. So I think it, it's, it's kind of like the same, like in the same vein of things that to change your life, you have to be motivated, right? Because motivation mm-hmm. is the thing that mm-hmm. kind of drives you. Yep. And to stay motivated all the time is very difficult. So a lot of times people will say the answer is discipline. But for a person that like me who gets distracted very easily, discipline is is hard, mm-hmm. right? And so, and 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 then I read something like you know when we try to to change something about our lives, like a bad mm-hmm. habit or something, is you just like, okay, no, I'm gonna go cold again. I'm gonna change my life, and then you just drop it, and then it will come back. So I read something that basically it's very it's impossible for you to do that because you do that already as a coping mechanism. So for you to get rid of that bad habit, you have to replace that coping mechanism. So until you can find something to to replace it, like say you're trying to to like mm. quit cigarettes, right? Yeah. You smoke it because you're stressed, mm-hmm. or you smoke it because of I don't know whatever reason, right? So if you just cut cold turkey, you're too stressed and you have nothing to cope that stress. So it's gonna be impossible for you to quit. So you have to find something to relieve your stress, and then it will like kind of like overtake. Wait, the question is how to lose weight, right? Yeah. Oh my yeah, God, so I'm just saying that because it's hard weight. because you're always stuck in this cycle of like. Okay, and also number one, I feel like don't focus on weight because you could be a very, very tall female with like heavy bones, right? Mm, I yeah, feel like weight true. is not yeah. a, a, a good number for whatever. Just the mirror. Mass and stuff. Yeah, actually. So I always will kind of say like, how do you want to look? How do you want to feel? How do, how, yeah. how do you want to feel in your body, right? Mm. I mean, you've lost mm. a lot of weight because you wanted to become like lighter, fitter and now you're like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. How do you do it? What keeps you motivated? Because even for me, and people really always assume that I'm always working out. That I'm mm-hmm. like, yeah, I, 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 right? I also have the assumption. But now. you work out way more than I do, like legit. Okay, like yeah. right now, I basically just go wake surfing once a week. Oh, what yes. happens? And then maybe I go yoga or do yoga here and there. Because, and I have a gym at, in my house. Mm. And then this falls back on the motivation thing. I like literally look at it every day. I'm like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, were you, were you overweight before? I was chubby, yeah. After I left secondary school, I, I put on quite a lot of weight. And okay. then that's when I started trying to lose weight and doing the most ridiculous things. I took all sorts of pills. I tried all sorts of diets. Ah. I tried everything. Mm. Like, literally everything. I was like 16 years old and I felt like I was fat. So, like, people would stop me on the road. And you know, I tried to do slimming things. Oh. Yeah, I would go over those things. Because what? I'm like, I try, I'm like, Please don't let me be fat. Please don't let me be called like Thunder Times anymore. You oh, mean the one where yeah. they like wrap you in like food? Yeah, and then yeah. they like roll oh, then, you. Yeah, and, like, then they put you in the, like uh, an oven. Wait, then, how do you know? I, I went. I went oh, before. Tried also. Yeah, I tried it. Okay, can I ask you something? How what? does p- wrapping your body in fruits, how is that supposed to make you lose weight? Fruits? fruits? Yeah, yeah you haven't seen it. They want to wrap <laughs> you, brother. I thought they wrap you in the plastic. The plastic yeah. Yeah. Why the they wrap you in wrap, fruits. Wrap. <laughs> Inside what the kind of sleeping <laughs> things have you been for, Jay? Yeah, that sounds hey, quite awesome, actually. Girl, I don't hey, no, think but it was you, a, no, hey, but Was it Stephen Lim selling that shit? <laughs> 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 it's like me, <laughs> me, me and Stephen Lim in his HGB and he's like wrapping me in fruits, right? <laughs> he's like, girl, this will make you skinny. <laughs> yeah, and he's like when he was selling no. his eyebrow thing. No, no, no. I just <laughs> saw it on TV once. Like this lady went for a steaming thing and then they were like, like, you know, Dora, whatever, Dora weight loss. And then like they put fruits on her body and then they What kind of fruits? Uh, oranges. How does mm. that make sense? Fruits. Okay, I okay, mean... If let's say... Okay, let's try to figure out the science here, right? Okay, okay I think it's fake, yes. Extract shit from your body, let's say. Like, that's, that's one way. Yeah, but that don't work. Don't, yeah, don't but work and like the that. fruits is sugar. Exactly. <laughs> it goes back into your... Wait, you, I don't think you can absorb sugar from your skin. From your skin? Yeah, like outside. Oh, no lah. Yeah lah. Then what, what's the fruits going to do? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> it's for the aesthetic. <laughs> but okay, maybe if anything, it'll be a mild exfoliant. Because of the sit- the vitamin C and it's uh, like brightening. Oh wow, you're so smart. And yeah. then maybe they squeeze you hard enough they can squeeze some liquid out of you <laughs> and then you lose water weight. But I've, I've never heard of wrapping yourself yeah, in I've never heard that. It's my so. first time. Well, thanks, it thanks was a that, TV Gem. show. I'm going to go and Google this now. It was a uh, Her Luan Chun. I don't know if anyone watched that. Channel 8. Her no. Luan Chun, Holland Village. Okay, no. never mind. No. Oh, Holland V. Holland V, yeah. Okay, it was okay, a okay. 7 o'clock Chinese Okay, but wait. Show. Back to the question. Okay, my advice is what people don't get about uh, this is that it is never a sprint. It's a marathon. Mm. Like you have it's to keep marathon. it up for yeah. years. And yeah. where and what you are sorry, you don't want to lose. I say you want to lose weight. In that process of losing weight, weight, what you want to do is find something sustainable. Mm-hmm. It's always like these few things I'll say. Um, 
if you just want to start out, eat half of everything you're eating now. No, you can't say that. Why? What if they're already eating very little? Yeah, you don't know. Okay, I, 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 for me, what I would do or what I did, if I really need to like cut for a shoot or whatever, I need, I'm just like, okay, I gotta look more mm. like ready. <laughs> you don't drink water. I just cut, sh- uh, cut sugar. Yeah. Oh, yeah okay. Because, and oh, I still like, sugar. don't drop your carbs, don't drop your protein. So, mm. okay, cut your carbs in half. Yeah. If you can, cut out all processed sugar, but that, that makes me so cranky. But like, mm. cut as much, as much as you can and then just up your vegetable and protein intake. That's all. But for someone who never worked out before, like if you tell me this four years ago, I'll ask you to shut up. Yeah. Like, you know? like what what are you talking about? Oh my god, what facts. Is- I was thinking like shut up. Yeah. Like, what <laughs> is I, processed sugar? sugar. What is sugar. Not, right? Oh, okay, okay. Sugar that's <laughs> not natural. Again, sugar that was okay, not, okay, not, like not like basically. Now that I'm more knowledgeable that. to me, sugar yeah, yeah, is sugar. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, basically junk food. That's exactly yeah. Right. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Don't if you just don't eat junk food, that helps a lot. And okay. there was a period of time where I just avoided looking at McDonald's or KFC. Okay, but see, like, even I if I was on that. a diet, yeah. I would still eat McDonald's. Okay, I wouldn't. Really? I, I wouldn't. Because but there's no sugar in McDonald's. But it's gross. I would reward myself <laughs> is, yeah, for McDonald's. Like after mm-hmm. one month, okay, I earned this McDonald's meal. But one month, yeah, that's too yeah. long, bro. Why I try. You I know, the longest I've gone with McDonald's is, is, th- is three months. Okay, wait, but see, when, when you look at food and what to eat, right? Mm-hmm. Do you choose it and you say it's unhealthy because of the calorie content or because of nutritional value or because of like sugar? I mean, sugar and okay. of course junk food. And but because I mean, what the media tells you, lah. Um, not lah. Like, I'm sure there's like science behind that also, lah. Like, I wouldn't. I mean, but then again, there's this one guy that ate Big Macs for like what fifty yeah, years. Yeah, he was and fine, he's, and he's fine. I mean, yeah. I guess. Okay, the science. I, I guess this person is like you know don't know anything. Let's, McDonald's let's, is good though. Yeah, it is. It no, is. McDonald's is disgusting. No, <laughs> because not because of the Fuck food. Like spicy. No, it but it's, it just tastes bad. The cooperation. No, it's like the bread is not good. The meat is not good. What do you mean? Not enough pickles. Okay, not enough pickles. Okay, not you know what? pickles. Fast, like, it's not good. Okay, it's very high quality fast food. How about Carl's Jr. No, shake shake. Oh, the double western so bacon good. cheeseburger. How about in and out? Oh, okay, in and out, in and out. Yeah. Oh, but in and out so I'm down greasy for though. In. But it's not about the health content. I'm but not. How it tastes, your mouth it's how it so feels. Like gelat, yeah, you know? I want good food, like okay, yummy. What about five guys. Five guys is good. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like five guys. Okay, how about but you? But when need people to try say like I treat myself at McDonald's, I'm like, no, you didn't treat yourself. You punish yourself. It's bad. So bad. Oh, I, yeah, I guess because it's so bad, it's good. Yeah, it's no, so it's bad, not. It's <laughs> you know, I, I wouldn't say no to a McSpicy or a quarter. You know what the best burger is? Okay, McSpicy. If you also like, you don't want to have extra calories, is to have Carl's Jr. Portobello mushroom low cup wrap. So it's okay, no. okay. So you can have double p- meat patties with like the bunch. It's like mushroom Swiss. I, l- I fucking love that. And then it's just wrapped in lettuce, and mm. it's so good. It's like eating a salad hamburger with meat and mushrooms. Uh, oh, I feel like I'm not selling salad. it very well. It's a wrap, lah. It's a wrap. Yeah, uh, but it's like a burger wrap. A wrap okay, okay. without the tortilla. Without the carbs, yeah. yeah. Isn't yeah. that better? So no yeah. carbs. You're just eating like. Protein mm, and, mm. And, and vegetables. No, man. Me and you are like, let's. <laughs> we were just like, after this, let's go and have another sambal stingray. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Every oh, every time okay, we finish okay, stream, okay. we like, we love to go and have like sambal stingray and then have like giant portion of rice fried yu tian. <laughs> Wonderful. So we yeah. are like, not the people like to give you food. advice. Yes. That sounds good. Yeah. No, We're but like, um, to whoever is asking, uh, I guess your first step is okay, the, the math behind it or the science behind it is very easy. It's just energy in, and out. in yeah. energy out. So you need to know, wow, this, okay, it's quite technical, but just Google basic metabolic rate. And then you add in your weight, your age, and your height, and then you know how much calories you need to, so you need to have for you to live a day. But then do you feel that that's very stressful? Because for me, like yeah, counting my yeah. calories is so stressful and yeah. it makes me not want to do it. Yeah, same, same. As it, yeah, yeah agree. Um, but it helps lah. No, it also helps. Start, yeah, if you're yeah. disciplined, okay, this is if you're disciplined. Mm. If you're not disciplined and you're having trouble trying to focus, then I would suggest just looking for something that's sustainable. Basically, yeah. something that's fun. Something you enjoy do- doing, like a new skill you want to learn. For example, like I just picked up wake surfing. But for example, you always want to do yoga, then go and do yoga. Mm. You want to learn Muay Thai, go learn Muay Thai. So learn something fun that's active. And then mm. losing weight and becoming fitter is a byproduct. Yes. And the, you're just true. having fun. And then you will want to do it. And yeah. then you will just like, Keep getting yeah. fitter. And I, you know, I wish I knew that earlier. Right. Because I only started boxing like two years ago, right? Mm. Mm-hmm. And, and like, my, this lifestyle, like, sorry, this healthy lifestyle is like, probably like, since 2017. So two years ago was 2020. So in that three years, I was just doing so many things. I like, ran marathons, like. Amazing. Yeah, so I'm like, wow, damn boring, right? But then when, I, until I picked up martial arts. Hey, sorry, bro. 
He's like, mm. I love no, okay. Jogging Gomez is very offensive. <laughs> no, I was gonna ask. Jogging gonna Gomez ask, is have, not happy. Do you have somebody in your inner circle, like a trusted friend, to hold you accountable to whatever you say you're gonna do? Like you tell him, okay, I'm gonna learn boxing, I'm gonna lose weight. So does oh, no he la. or she keep you in check? No. Oh, not okay. at all. No one, no one kept me no. in check. Yeah, they just like do whatever lah. Well done then. Oh, yeah, because really? I, yeah. I had someone to, like make sure that I was on track and going. You had a trainer. A trainer as well as a good friend of mine mm-hmm. was like, mm-hmm. okay, how much are you today? Do you have McDonald's? No? Okay, good. Well done. Why is it McDonald's? Enough no, with the McDonald's. It's, it's my guilty pleasure. I love McDonald's. Stop so, yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. Sponsor Talk. McDonald's if you want to. Yeah, so I, my, my, my <laughs> advice is... You know, once they speak- asked me to do Sorry. like, they asked me to work with them before. Okay and I was like, hell no, I hate your food. So <laughs> Why you said that? I said I fucking hate your food. I would gladly work with you guys if you're <laughs> yeah, yeah, watching this, if please. Just yeah. sponsor me one McSpicy. They were like, would you do an ad like a like a TV? I was like, fuck off. It's what if, they, what if they paid you a million dollars? No. Really? It's bad food. No two one should million? eat that. It doesn't taste good. Okay, if hey, you have two million dollars, okay, then buy some better meat. I don't know why Singaporean meat. person that hates Max Spicy yeah. Double. Oh, I, hey. I don't hate it, but I don't eat it. So what's your go-to burger? Wait, let me guess. <laughs> Double filet. I tell you what's damn good. No. Ramli. Okay, like I mean, Ramli is, is... A good okay, Ramli okay. burger. I feel like If it's Ramli burger gave best. me two dollars, I would do an it. If okay, Ramli Burger gave me a whoa, burger, that's I would do an it. I would but work wait, for The Ramli. Singaporean Ramli patty or the actual Ramli patty no, the, in Malaysia? Like, no, it's like the Ramli, like Ramli and the yellow, like yeah, Ramli, yeah, Ramli, the, Ramli the, like the yellow. The patty in Singapore is different as compared to the one in Malaysia. Oh. I think mm. it has to be from a Malaysian roadside okay, store. Okay, then, then you got to go and to And then it's got to have like egg in it. It gotta have yeah. egg in it too. Yeah, la, Ramli special. La. Yeah, fucking yeah. Ramli special. Okay, but enough of McDonald's. Let's help this 90 kg girl who wants to lose weight. Yes. You can do it, girl. I believe in you. Pick a spot. Pick a spot, yeah. Don't um, as in what helped me as in when I when I started boxing, I didn't care about my weight or mm. my how uh-huh. I do everything. Yeah. I just want to be a better boxer. Yeah, full stop. that helps so much. Yeah. Just focusing on the skill. And then you yeah. just the weight loss, everything yeah. will, will just and come you, with it. You look in the mirror, yeah. and be like, whoa, I kind of look like I like how I look. And then yeah. you just keep like yeah. working out, and then you just look better, and like you're like, whoa, and then you're super motivated. Yeah, you know and then you're, fun. Your trainer you all will do tell like you? PE when you were young. Did mm. everyone here do PE? Oh, I love, I PE. love PE. That was my, my favorite. favorite. Oh my god, I hated PE. Oh, I hated PE. because oh, I feel you played soccer. I felt no, because like, <laughs> in PE I felt like a loser. You know what I mean? Like, I felt like a loser. Like, no one wanted me on their team except the girls. Like, if the guys were picking teams, I would get picked like one of the last because I'm like not fit. Right. And I and I hated it. I didn't like to run. It was fucking hot and I had humongous breasts. So every time I had to. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she's like, just being, no, it's valid yeah, information she's though. Being, being honest. So yeah. when you're young, right? Then like I was like, I think I was in P3 or 4 and we couldn't like wear bras. But I, no, like I can't remember when I started developing breasts like 10. Wait, and you we cannot? didn't have bras. We No, we didn't have bras. Like, oh. I didn't have them. But you could see my like brown nipples through my uniform. So it was that damn gross I felt like oh my god this is so ugly and then like when I started getting huge breasts like they would bounce and then like the guys would all just sit there and be like oh shit wow. yeah while well, I was while well, be running on the track oh, man. give them yeah. now ah. they appear on TikTok gonna cancel uh. what like those men I feel like okay, uh-huh. never mind, never mind. No, okay, like, imagine, like, being 17 years old is fucking hot, and like, I look very, like, I'm tired. I'm wearing this, like, thin pea costume. I have these big breasts, and they're, like, bouncing on the nine. You can literally see the guys laughing from the stands, and you know what they're talking about. It's so oh. gross. I hated it. I hated PE. I feel oh, like... Joking, I bet Joking was one of them. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I feel like young, as you grow young up... young and foolish, <laughs> young, young and stupid. I mean, you're, you're, I mean, look, you're a 14, 15, 16-year-old boy. Mm. You're raging testosterones. You want to be cool with your friends. You make all these kind of stupid jokes. That's true. I, yeah. I, and I'm, I'm not proud of and it. And worse. And worse. But like, then, I guess, as you grow up and you find a spot that you actually love in a supportive environment, you actually learn like there's so much joy in moving your body. Mm. But there's something that you need to commit to. So you need to find something that you love. So I'm yeah. so like on like I'm so like on it with like you and yeah. like, Riley, sorry, yeah. not Sandra. But whatever right. is health health is a uh, wow, it's so important. Like after you get into that, yeah, find then the you joy. Realize that, oh my it. god. Like health is so important, like you can do so much more when you're yeah, healthy. Yeah. When you're like mobile, just being Yeah. Hey, mobile. Last time I cannot like when squat. I no, I can squat but uh I cannot reach for my Shoes oh, without my tongue. Oh, there you yeah, go. My yeah, oh, yeah, getting yeah. in the way? Yeah. Really? Oh, that must yes. be really annoying. Wow. Actually. Yeah, like How do you tie whatever your shirt I wear last time will fold. Then your shoelaces? Yeah, so like if I do this. Then how? Lah? Like, mm. Our pen. Like, oh, because your, your lungs are like. Wow. Oh. Yeah, it was that bad. I feel you. Mm. Yeah, mm. so like you climb the stairs, done. Fuck. Damn. Like, you're done for the fucking day, you know? Like, you're, I get so angry if you're, it was very hot. Oh my god. Like, wow. it, like, eh, like at 32 degrees, I'd be like, fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it was just because I was fat. That was me when I was pregnant. 
I couldn't see my shoes. Couldn't see my feet. Of course, so I got Some baby so big. You. No, but like I know what you mean. Like yeah. it's like it really like you can't bend. Yeah, but can't you know walk, after nine months it's gonna be over. You know. Yeah. That's true. Oh, did it feel the but same for you? <laughs> no, no, yeah. But it could be over in nine months. Yeah. Could have. But actually, to be honest, really I did not. I was that fat. I always thought I was fat? like 80, 90, but I was 105. I was very fat. Oh, you didn't weigh yourself? I did weigh myself. Wow. Do you ever look at a, at a before picture of yourself and go like, what in the world was that? Oh, man? yes. Yeah. Are you were still cool though. Yeah. Fat or not? Yeah, Jade loves... Eh, no, not Jade. Muna loves the fat me. So will you go... No way la, siao. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I feel it's all, all about how you accept yourself. If you look at yourself and go, hey, I can look better, then yeah, go for it. But if you're mm. happy the way you are, if, if you're all right, you know, if your health is okay, don't force yourself to do something you don't want to do. I feel yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, correct. Yeah. You're right, you're right. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. What is your biggest regret? Oh, <gasps> yeah. It's right there. Leaving. Have a look. No <laughs> regret. Uh, wait, you got. You didn't laugh. You guys just disbanded. What is your biggest regret? <laughs> I yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's really funny, but I cannot say this. I'm not opening my own can of worms. Okay, basically, I did an ad for a certain <laughs> brand and I highly, extremely, that was like the one ad I really, really, really regretted. Wow. So bad. Why? Because I really didn't want to do it in the first place. And then I thought I was like, okay, cool. Because you know then when you're first starting out, you take any job you can get, you know? Okay. And if it's a job with, with like a, 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 a big brand, it's like, ah, okay, I'll just take it, right? So they were, they were looking for like Malay, Chinese, Eurasian, Indian. And then, so obviously, they were trying to cast me as like the Chinese girl. Mm. But I don't look like the Chinese girl, right? So I thought, like, okay, I just try. I probably won't get it anyway. I went in and then they, I guess they, they wanted me maybe because I just started with Samuel's then. Yeah. So maybe got a bit of pop or whatever. But, and then they were like, oh, but can you don't go in the sun? Can you like, you know, because you're too tan? <gasps> can you, can you oh. don't go in the sun so much? Don't go in the sun so much. Don't go in the sun so much. Don't go And then they would be like, oh, then can we spray your hair black? You know, can we basically make you look like a... <laughs> a stereotypical Chinese yeah, girl Yeah exactly you go. Yeah. So then I was a bit really like mm, I don't feel wanted But then like Okay $800 I'm like Okay you know $800 then is like a lot of money yeah. It's still a lot of money But yeah, yeah, yeah. it's $800 for sure I'm like okay mm-hmm. And then so I went in for casting And then it's like I hate You know when they're like Oh smile do this And I, I don't like doing that Like, uh-huh. But then they make me do Damn cheesy Oh happier Happier I mean I like to do this On my own accord But not when someone Directs me to do it <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> You know yeah, yeah, what I mean I, I, like, I You totally feel get what stupid you mean, yeah. And I and just like Feel like Ugh, Why are you making me do this It's not me at all But they wanted like It's super campy Then I was gonna pull out already I was gonna mm. pull out But then I could I didn't know how to say no Then I went in And then they were like Oh actually there's a song Actually we were thinking Of having you sing it Then I'm like Oh interesting Interesting yeah. Let me hear the song And I oh, got the song <laughs> It's okay. Well, it's, you it's, have it's to show us this app. I yeah. can. I will show it to you when we're not. <laughs> the, like because I'm so scared people are gonna search it and then it's gonna come back like out. Did okay. the ad get backlash though? That's my question. No, no, it, it didn't. It, okay. it didn't okay. because um, no, I, I don't see how it would have except backlash from my friends. <laughs> like, won't stop playing and I the one I really hated. Okay, Sorry. maybe because also I got made fun of. Because I was really uncomfortable about, situ- about the situation, so then maybe. You so know. it's the process of doing it that you regret. Oh, but, the, yeah, okay. So f- filming, and then, okay, so I didn't sing the song, but then I had to lip sync the song, so it wasn't like any better, and mm. I couldn't get out of it. Uh-huh. And then I had to like be like super happy on set, so <sighs> I. If you watch the ad, I'm like trying to like cover my face and like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, yeah. Yeah. Look, I'm sure all four of all four of us when we're starting out in our careers, especially in the media industry, we have done things that we regret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A plenty. Yeah. 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 You know, the, my greatest pet peeve is like, you know when they say, uh, what did they ask you to do? Be happier? Like, like more, more. Ah, ah, bigger, ah. bigger. I hate bigger. it when um, uh, people hire me to host stuff and then they say, please be funny. Oh. Ah. Wow. <laughs> I feel like if you tell me to be funny, then I would not yeah, be funny anymore. Why. Yeah, because I feel like I feel like I say I I would like to think that people hire me to host because I am funny. Yeah. But if you tell me, oh, do you... We, we need you to be funny or please be funny. I'm like, I'm not fucka fast, you know, where I have, like, I can say jokes on like the jokes, spot. Like jokes, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't write jokes. Try. <laughs> yeah. I feel hey, like, I must write. be funny, yeah. Must ah, try. Yeah. <laughs> must oh, that's really annoying. I can see how, I'm really annoyed. Yeah, I, yeah, like, I, yeah, hey, I be funny. Uh, hey, uh, do you mind if you are a bit more funny? And then oh. he's like, how? <laughs> what do we do, right? Like, he'll be a clown? I'm sure if right. Fast gets there, he gets Dance pissed around. as well. Oh, he gets like, pissed. Someone tell them, be funny, fast. Or like, hey, tell a joke fast. 
No, but you 100%. know what's so annoying? It's because like the kind of humor we do is not like joke humor, right? So, and it's also a bit off color. So then when they hire us for corporate ads, first they'll be like, we want you to be yourself. Mm. And then you submit an ad where like your tits are out because that's my fucking brand. Mm. They'll be like, cover up. Mm. Yeah, I so hate that. I so then hate or that. The, for deal, it's like you hire hi, you know you hire him and then you tell him to be funny, but you also don't want like off color jokes. Yeah. Then why hire him in the first place? Oh yeah, my god! Do oh that. my god! They Look don't at want you, but a different crea- insert creative name here, like Shopee's song. Kind of like that. We I love Shopee Kinda. to be honest. No, I, Shop- I have a theory Shopee about Shopee. They, I love they, Shopee they, though. No, they know their jingles sound a certain way. But they know it but works. But they are camping on it because it's brand recall. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it is. Shop, shop, it's like. Look for a brand to yeah. get Cristiano and to do the dance. Yeah. Well done, Shopee. You do, do you remember the song? Yeah. Yeah. Shopee, beep, 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 beep. And he goes buy <laughs> everything at Shopee. <laughs> Who is that? Jackie Chan oh, one. Like Cristiano. Like Chan one. Cristiano. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 Right. Now it's Naomi and so I mean you so far. Hey, I must say I Naomi. It, Naomi okay. did it very well though. Yeah, yeah. she did. She looked hot though. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, so wow. I'm like, okay, go girl. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if she's watching this, but I become a fan of Naomi. I feel I like am, her yeah. her content Hell has really yeah. changed ever since she became a mom. Like, yeah. I, I enjoy watching her TikToks. It's, it's so fun to watch. But my question is whether will her son, when he's like 15, 16, go back to watch all these videos going, Mom, why are you going to put me like that online? Mom, yeah. why? Yeah, I think he will love it. It's so cute. Yeah, he yeah. is. He she is. Never, like, no, I've always wondered, like, like, what if yeah, I have kids exactly. and then like, oh, daddy, what do you do? How do I explain? Oh my god, my... Okay, so I, I actually was in the same situation with my niece. Uh. She told me, she was like... Auntie Jade, are you famous? And I was like, no. And then she was like, I saw you on YouTube. And then my heart stopped. I was like, what the fuck <gasps> did wow, you which see? Episode? Yeah, which episode? And she was like, yeah, you're a teacher, right? Jen Tao Tai. Oh, wow. Oh, thank God. Oh, she saw me oh. on Yeah, I was oh, like, yes, I am. God. Yes, that one. No, but there will, there will come a time when all of us have kids. And then we will probably be like 50 or 55. Uh-huh. And they are like 20 or internet smart. And they'll Google our names and they'll go, oh, Oh, dad. Last time Singapore, I do like that. Why wow, you're terrible? Like no, that. they love yeah. you. So my niece nah, loves you. That'd be joking. so cool. So like yeah. inspirational. Exactly. They love that, you. My dad did that. I'll be like so excited. And then when like, dad did imagine that. if, for example, we 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 make a small mistake in our career and it gets blown out of proportion, and then it will always scandal. stay there forever. Yeah. Okay, yeah, but that would be. But <laughs> Jo Kim said hi to my niece, and yeah. I'm a champion. That day, she was like. She was telling people like, you know my auntie's famous, she knows famous people like Joe Kim Gomez. Oh. And I was like, yo, he did a shout out to her and made her the coolest. She's oh. now the coolest. The innocence so of a kid. Nice. Thank She's you so much, coolest. Jade's niece. We love you. Thank oh, you so much. Wow. Oh, I kind of hope she, she yeah. shouldn't be watching this, right? No, no. I mean, no, no she's not on Twitch. She's uh, six. <laughs> But oh. she's like, yes, my auntie is so famous. She knows how people like Joe Kim? Kim. Because he's on the radio. Oh, oh. I thought from Singapore Idol. I'm like, That's wait, crazy. what? She's no, she radio. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. No. Would you do OnlyFans? <laughs> no. Dude, you guys tried to say, we had uh, Titans on the show and yeah. uh, Dude was getting tips from like the no, top OnlyFans creator. I, he was, I feel like... Not, not. If you can, like make bank. No. You yeah. literally wanted to start an OnlyFans for Fuck our you. show. For you. <laughs> no. I, I said, I, I said no. if you have OnlyFans, I invest into it. Hell no. I'll buy you the cameras. I'll buy you. Yeah. <laughs> Hell I'll no. buy you uh, so many things. Wait, I'm just so, trendy. okay, I, I, I just want to clarify. What's the what's the grey area here in Singapore? What's the rule? Like, you can do OnlyFans but no nudes. Yeah. No, like, for yeah. as long as no, you no, no nudes. Like, and okay, no nudes. So, yeah, okay, so yeah, just bikini so pictures. Yeah. And yeah. V- very much what we can see on Instagram already, if you think just, about it. Just like, I think nipples are or more, okay. Or more provocative. Like, yeah. or like, more like, you can wear a net bra. Like, a bra that is As long as it covers... Like and you can play with your nipples, nipples oh, but the second you put anything in your bum, then you're like, no. Wait, yeah. there's, there's actually like a written thing where you can... No, no. pornography. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. There we go. But you could be like, this is up, just not pornography. But <laughs> How to be shareholder of Jade OnlyFans? Nope. No, we will start and then when we go public, we will let you guys know. Hell <laughs> no! <laughs> like IPO, Jets, OnlyFans. Hey, that, never, wow, that never. That will make news. I don't care, never. What if it never. was just a surprise and then it's What if it's a surprise, else? OnlyFans? Like, <laughs> <laughs> the content is a surprise. So it's not what people expect. Ah. Jake giving a foot massage to you. Yeah. That's, that's OnlyFans content. That is OnlyFans content right there. Actually. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. no. That's so awesome. for uh, April Fools, I like posted a link and I said like, okay, it's time. Like you guys oh, have been fans, asking so. uh, link in bio. That's why I said, I said link in bio, which is dot whistle for OnlyFans, right? 
And then I had like a link to like, you know, my link tree page it was that only fans link. And when you click it, it's a picture of me standing in front of a bunch of industrial fans. <laughs> <laughs> so that was my April Fool's Day trick. But then when I went back to check, how many people I cl- clicked the link? 50,000. 50,000. And I was just thinking if I charge, if I charge $10 each. I mean, you know that you have a market there, Bank. AJ, but it's um, just... Yeah, let me invest. It, right? No, no, no. Shh. Ask Kisha. She'll say, she'll say no too, but you can ask her instead. Actually, Muna might say yes, you know? No, <laughs> she'll say no. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you guys have questions, um, the mods will send you the link to send the questions. Uh, we also have a YouTube channel called, uh, and, and on the bottom right of your screen, or bottom left of the screen, we do cut this episode for uh, as, a, as a short version, a short version, a short version on YouTube. So please go and watch that. Again, if you have any questions, let us know. Uh, there's a website for you to submit your question and if you would like to see Sandra or Joakim back on stream again let us know and then we will invite them and, and see if they want to come yeah <laughs> and see if they want to see if they want to yeah, come see, see what the prize is see what the prize see is what the time. games are yeah. Yeah. <laughs> next yeah. next stream you need to ask do you like do you are there prizes <laughs> yeah. but okay guys uh, bye-bye. bye bye bye